up y'all welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome and if you're returning thank you so so much for coming back and joining me in another video all right y'all so for today well not today but this week I am filming a vlog but not just any vlog I'm doing a fall vlog I'm excited because I'm gonna be doing a few things this week that I feel like it's gonna set the vibe and the mood for the fall season so of course I wanted to share with you guys um, right now I'm actually heading to my nail appointment it is bright and early on a Wednesday morning y'all and I'm still tired so if I sound like I'm asleep I actually this is the first time I've spoken so yeah um, heading to my nail appointment right now um, I'm excited because I usually get like simple colors like this it's kind of just like a brown with a design um, I usually do like simple fall designs with like different fall colors, but this time I'm actually going to switch it up just a little bit and I'm actually going to get something festive for Halloween. Now, if y'all know me, I don't do anything too crazy out there, um, colorful, anything like that. So it's not going to be too crazy. I like to keep it simple, keep it classy, keep it cute but it is going to be a little festive of course i'll show you guys once my nails are done um and then after that i do want to go to trader joe's i want to see if i can find like some fall goodies treats just see what they have i hope i'm not too late to the game because i remember last year when i was um when i went to trader joe's for like fall things i went back like a couple weeks later and all the fall things were like sold out and it was still very early in the season so I'm hoping I am not too late um, and they still have some things out but yes I'll catch up with you guys once my once I'm finished with my nail appointment so I'm back in the car from getting my nails done can y'all even see it's so bright I'm gonna have to show y'all when I'm not in direct sunlight but I'm headed to Starbucks right now because I was rushing out the house this morning and I did not eat anything there you go so cute um, I didn't eat didn't have time to eat anything and I also didn't get any coffee or I haven't had anything today and it's 12 o'clock now so I need to put something in my system I kind of don't want to get coffee from Starbucks though I kind of want to wait until I get back home and just make a coffee but I have been craving like a refresher so that's probably what I'm gonna get um, and then something to eat, of course. So, I'm gonna go there first before I go to Trader Joe's because I do not need to be going in there hungry because I'm gonna just pick up more than, you know, what I need. Y'all, my nails are so cute. So, my girl Christy, she always has my nails. Um, unless she has something else going on or she's busy, she is who I go to. And she gets it right every single time. Every time. Never misses. Um, she did a phenomenal job this time. Um, usually I go with her, go to her with like a an inspiration picture, but or video. But today I kind of pulled from like different pictures and ideas that were just like in my head, and she executed it be beautifully, perfectly. So I really love my nails. They are so cute so like festive but still dainty you know she knows what I like she gets the vibe so yeah I'm gonna run into Starbucks really quickly this one isn't a drive-thru so I have to go inside unfortunately I'm just gonna like place my order ahead of time and then just like run in and pick it up because who has time why is this not a drive-thru by now um but anyways that's what I'm about to do okay so I made it to Starbucks I just placed my order and it looks like I have like five minutes or so before it'll be ready so I'm just waiting outside in the parking lot because I don't want to go in there and then it's not ready and I have to stand there and wait you know um but yeah I'm excited I got a refresher I got a strawberry well I'll show you guys when I get it but I got something to eat as well and a refresher and yeah i'm excited i'm excited to go to trader joe's i really hope that they still have like fall things there fall items because if not i'm gonna be so sad but either way i'm still gonna pick up like some of my favorite items that they have so it'll be fine but hopefully they still have like some fall goodies you know i'm excited though i'm excited to be filming this vlog i feel like i haven't done a vlog in so long like 
honestly, I don't think I've vlogged maybe since like May. I think since May it was like my last time that I actually vlogged. I mean, I've been posting, but not like vlogs, you know? And honestly, I haven't been, this year, I have not been as consistent as I would like to be. So that is definitely one of my goals for next year is just to get on a better schedule and to be more consistent with my like filming schedule and whatnot. So I'm so excited. I cannot wait to eat right now. I don't know why I did this to myself. I waited until this time to eat. I really should have woken up at the time that I was supposed to get up and got something to eat before I left the house, but I didn't. Anyways, I'm gonna go pick my order up and I'll be right back. All right, we got the goods, y'all. I got a strawberry acai refresher with peach juice, no lemonade, and seven pumps of raspberry syrup. And then I also got extra um extra scoops of the little strawberry dried strawberry pieces too and then i also got an impossible breakfast sandwich and a cheese danish did i need both of those absolutely not but did i get them absolutely yes so yeah that's what i got i'm gonna enjoy it on my way to trader joe's and i'll actually see you guys once i get back home because i don't like filming in trader joe's it's always hectic and busy and it's too much going on so i'll see y'all when i get back home For some reason, I have been just loving roses recently, so just like different colors. And I decided to go with this like peachy orange kind of color and then the yellow to kind of mix in with it. I'm not a florist, I'm not a professional, but I feel like they look pretty good. I mean, I feel like it's giving fall. If you hear my dogs in the background, well, mainly my boy dog, he's right behind me. He's such a whiny baby. Right, but I'm gonna show y'all all the goodies that I got from Trader Joe's really quickly. Um, just a reminder, this is not my, I feel like you guys are crooked. I think you guys are crooked. There we go. This is not my official grocery shopping for the week. I only specifically got snacks and like different treats and stuff that were like fall, well, most of them are like fall themed for tonight and also for this weekend. So there is no real groceries in here. Okay. <laughs> All right. So I'm gonna start with this bag. This is the first thing I got. I just wanted to try them. I've heard a lot of people talk about them. These are the Bomba puffed peanut and corn snacks with hazelnut cream filling. Um, I'm not really a fan of peanut butter and chocolate, so I don't know if I'm gonna like these or not, but I do like hazelnut and it says peanut and corn snack so it's not actual like peanut butter so i'm gonna try them and see if i like them if not it's a small bag so whatever i also got this maple and maple strudel streusel maple streusel bread um i tried this for the first time last year and i really liked it it's really good i feel like just as like a quick breakfast or something to uh, eat while you're drinking your coffee in the morning or whatever so i got that this is gonna be for this weekend these are little hot chocolate um melts i guess you can say it says that they're mexican style hot chocolate melts they are cinnamon flavored with white chocolate 
confections filled with milk chocolate drops and marshmallows so it sounds really good um, assuming you just get like warm milk or water whatever your preference is and then just drop this in there and it makes hot chocolate so hopefully these are good we're gonna try it this weekend and then y'all i saw these salsa verde flavored tortilla chips and i originally just picked up one but the lady at the register was like these are so good you're gonna not want to put them down so i was like well let me just get two because it's for this weekend there's gonna be at least three of us here and i was like for one if there's three of us we might need more than one of these one of these little bags but then also if i want to try them ahead of time or if i like them i'll have extra as well so i got two bags of these hopefully they are good and then to go with that i also got the salsa verde salsa from trader joe's as well i have not tried trader joe's salsa verde salsa y'all i had fresh authentic that's the word i'm looking for um salsa verde from one of my co-workers and nothing has compared since i've had that so we'll see how this turns out then i just got these or this cinnamon roll drizzled granola did i need this absolutely not not necessarily fall themed but i saw it it caught my eye and i was like i'ma try it it just looks so so good and i feel like it would be it would be delicious on like um just like plain or not plain but like vanilla or honey yogurt and then the last thing in this bag is these k-cups i got the maple coffee cups autumn maple coffee cups i'm gonna try this today actually because i haven't had my coffee yet so i'm gonna try this just with like regular um sweet cream creamer so hopefully that is good i'm excited to try that and then in this bag i just got this um vegan brioche bread not fall themed at all but i really like this bread i feel like it tastes really good by itself or even just with um by itself with like a sandwich or even um really good in, to make like french toast out of i've kind of been craving grilled cheese so i may or may not try to make grilled cheese i don't know i kind of forgot how they taste like if they're sweet at all obviously i'm not going to use it for grilled cheese i'll just do like french toast or just eat it plain but I can't remember if it's like just like regular bread then i'm gonna try to make grilled cheese with it so we're gonna see next thing i got were these pumpkin spiced pumpkin seeds i don't know if i like these or not um they looked really good so i'm gonna try them but if not my boyfriend really likes um nuts and seeds and things like this so he'll probably like them if i don't i also picked up one of these infamous pumpkin bread and muffin mixes i actually had a box of this last year and i made it and it was really good i made it as like pumpkin bread just to eat um kind of like what i would do with these um and it was really good so i got another one and they like stay they can stay in your pantry for a while so even if i don't eat it right away it'll be in there whenever i'm ready to make me some pumpkin bread to go with my coffee i also got these um pumpkin spice batons i don't know why it's called a baton i don't know i've never called it that but i got some of these as well to try just on the side with my coffee i don't know just being you know festive i guess setting the vibe setting the mood you know and then for tonight i got these um chocolate or they're pumpkin chocolate chunk oatmeal cookie mix it's a cookie mix so i'm gonna try this um i really like oatmeal cookies but i'm not a fan of raisins like oatmeal raisin cookies but i like oatmeal and this has chocolate chunks in it so i feel like it's gonna be good so i'm probably gonna make these for tonight later on and if i do i'll show you guys how they turn out and let you know if they taste good and then for this weekend i also got um these halloween jojo cookies um cheddar joe's have they have like different flavors of these jojo cookies but i got this one because it's kind of like an oreo it's just like a chocolate um cookie like an oreo but it's like in the shape of a pumpkin or the face of a pumpkin i guess you can say and it has vanilla bean cream filling on the inside so i feel like these are going to be really good as well just in case anybody isn't into like all the pumpkin -y stuff you know and then i also got these cookie butter cookies i really like their cookie butter spread that they have so i was like i kind of want to try these they're already in or they're in a cookie 
form like a cookie sandwich these are just for to keep in my pantry honestly through, throughout the holiday season so hopefully these are really good they're on a creamy cookie butter spread between two decadent butter cookies so yeah they're butter cookies with the spread in between them so i'm excited to try these as well then the last thing that i picked up are these pumpkin uh treats dog treats so i'm excited to see if they like these um i feel like my well my boy dog he's always been like into treats but my girl dog recently has just been getting into like liking treats and stuff too before she didn't like treats she would just eat her food and that was it if you put anything else around her she's like this ain't my food i don't want this but now she's like getting more into treats and stuff so i'm gonna probably try to give them um some of this later or a couple of these later tonight and i'll see if they like it so yeah y'all i'm about to just relax for a little bit um it's about two 235 in the afternoon now um, i'm gonna put this stuff away and then just relax we're actually going to see my niece later on i'm not gonna vlog during all that obviously because i don't want to like invade their privacy and we're going to spend time you know with them so I'm not gonna vlog all of that but we're gonna go see my niece and whatnot and later on when i get back like i said if i um or whatever i decide to do if i make those cookies then i will show you guys hopefully they turn out really good but yeah i'm gonna just get i'm just gonna rest a little bit and then i do have a video i need to finish it'll be the video that will go up right before this one actually it's my um fall clothing haul with a few pieces that i picked up from she in so i'm gonna go ahead and finish that video up so that way i can get that up for you guys as well and actually the shirt that i was wearing or the jacket i was wearing earlier today is from is in that haul so if you haven't checked it out i'll link it go ahead and check that out and yeah i'll catch up with you guys later once we get back home hey y'all so it's actually the next evening last night it was pretty late actually when we ended up getting home and by the time we got home we honestly were just so tired we were like let's just get ready for bed so that's what we did but tonight i am gonna go ahead and make the cookies and we're gonna have like a little movie night so it's the next day but as you can see i am in my pjs already i've already kind of gotten ready for bed or at least started getting ready for bed um and so now i can just make the cookies and we can have our little movie night and kind of just relax for the night so i'm going to show you guys making the cookies hopefully they're good like i said i haven't tried them we are trying them for the first time so hopefully they're good hopefully we like them but yeah we're gonna go ahead and do that now Hey y'all, it is Saturday and I'm excited. Whew, I'm out of breath y'all. I just ran up the stairs. I'm excited, today is Saturday. It's been a couple of days since you guys have last seen me, but I'm very excited for today because we are going to the pumpkin patch. I'm so excited y'all. We are taking my nieces, a couple of my nieces to the pumpkin patch. And um, after that, I think we're gonna pick something up to eat and then we're gonna actually come back I believe I'm not even showing myself I believe to my place um just to have like a little girls night 
in or whatever so i'm excited because for one we're going to the pumpkin patch and i'm excited about that because it's a fall you know thing fall vibe but also i'm excited just to spend time with my nieces and my sisters so yes i'm gonna hurry up because i'm not running late but if i keep talking i am gonna be running late so we gotta go and i almost forgot i wanted to show you guys what i was wearing so i have on my little she in um shacket and my she in t-shirt i'm calling this the pumpkin patch t-shirt if you guys didn't see my um haul she in haul go watch it because both of these items were included in there and then i also just have on these like cargo pants i believe i got these from pretty little thing i kind of don't remember and then i'm gonna be wearing i'll show you my shoes later i'm wearing these um whoa chunky like i guess chunky dead shoe kind of look um but they are from zara but i'll show them later so that is the fit for today got back home i'm upstairs right now because it's kind of loud downstairs but i just wanted to check in with you guys we ended up having a fun time we went to i think it's called halls don't quote me on this halls family farm something like that but that's where that's the pumpkin patch that we went to we went on a um hay ride i think is what they call it um, so that was fun and of course we picked out a couple pumpkins for the kids and I didn't end up picking out a pumpkin because I really wanted like a cute little white pumpkin like a small mini one but they didn't really have small ones and they also didn't have any other color except the orange pumpkins like the regular ones so I didn't end up getting any for myself but we just picked some out like for the kids so it was fun and then after that we went to Dave's Hot Chicken which you saw a little bit of we just took our food to go and then we also got pizza <laughs> Y'all, we're hungry. We're starving. We got also, also got pizza from Benny's here in Charlotte. So we're going to create our little spread. And I'm going to show you guys everything, of course. Lay everything out. And we're going to eat and we're going to have us a little fun girls night. Got our little spread going. Because I didn't even the chicken yet. Mm, it's okay. to do. Put my pizza right here. I mean, it's good. That's what I got. A slider. With some cheese and fries yeah, really and some liars. pizza. What you get? The same thing? Yeah. You got a slice of pizza and the same thing? Girl. And you got a tender yeah, and a slider. Girl. Right. She did. If I don't go back, my head is gone forever. I hear my heart. And it's my job. I don't know how I feel about this sauce. That's what I was saying. It's weird. Mm -hmm. It's not nasty. The sandwich no. is good when you put honey on it. This sauce, um, I'm sorry. It's sorry. Yeah. It tastes like Zaxby sauce, but not. Just really, it's a little more mayo. -y. It's really just that. Yeah. Yeah. It's too much mayo. Like that sauce has like a little swing to it. This is just basic yeah. No extras. And then they put a dash of paprika for some color. Yeah. And then got no smoke. Don't you push that door Don't you lift a finger when I'm around Tell me where I can do more Hey y'all, what's 
up. As you guys saw, I just made my little hot chocolate, which it doesn't really look like hot chocolate. I was surprised that it was orange, but we'll see how it tastes. I actually haven't tried it yet. I have it right here. I was kind of running out of whipped cream, so I did what I could with what I had. It's actually pretty good. We didn't get to make the hot chocolate bomb thingies, hot chocolate melts, I think it's what it's called, on the box. We didn't get to do it the other night because um, we ended up getting way too much food. <laughs> I mean, we ended up eating like we had leftovers and stuff, so it worked out, it was fine. But we were so hungry and then we literally bought food from Dave's Hot Chicken, Hot Chicken, I think that's what it's called, which really good by the way definitely recommend it and then we also got a slice of pizza from Benny's and if you guys don't know Benny's is this pizza place that makes like really big pizzas like the slice is like I don't even know bigger than my head so we each got a slice of pizza from there plus our food from Dave's hot chicken and we had a feast but after we were done with that we were so full that we just didn't eat anything else so we didn't end up making the little hot chocolate bombs um on saturday so it's tuesday now and i just made my little hot chocolate because i didn't really feel like having coffee today this morning so i just made the hot chocolate instead but yeah i am looking crazy but i just wanted to come on here to end off this video and off this vlog i had really fun these last few days really like last week a few days out of the last week <laughs> um just doing fall activities fall festivities fall fun so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did do not forget to give me a big thumbs up and subscribe if you are not already a lot of people i feel like majority of people that watch my videos are not subscribed so if you watched and you like definitely subscribe it really helps me out and i would really appreciate it so yes that'll be it y'all don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, y'all.